In this video clip, we will take a brief look at the options that are available in an access window in SysCAD. All unit operations in SysCAD have access windows and you get to these by right clicking on the unit operation. So we'll right click on P007 and we'll get to the access window which has a number of tabs. So we go to the first tab and we're going to talk about the buttons on this window. To start off with, you have a button called Tag Short. So at the moment the tags shown here are what we call the long tags, mass flow, valve flow, temperature in, density. If I click on the tag short, it changes those to the short tags, QM, QV, TI. If you do a cut and paste and you copy your tag, you'll get the short form, but the long form is often easier for people to read. So if I ta click on tag long, it takes us back to the long tags. The other button that you have is the more button. So currently, it's only showing a few tags. If I click on more, it'll show some of the tags that we saw are hidden. And you can see they've got a red cross next to them, which tells you that these tags are normally hidden. But if you need to see them, you click on the more button and then they're available. If you'd like one of those tags to be normally visible, for instance, this temperature tag, if I right click on that tag, then what I can do is say show field. And you can see the red cross has disappeared. And now when I go and click less, that tag will now always be visible. And similarly, if you want to hide a tag, if you don't usually want to see it, you can go back and right click on it and say hide field. And then that's not going to be normally visible, but the tag is still there. We also have this green button over here, which is what we call the refresh button. And if I click that, it just refreshes all the values in that access window. When you are solving a project, the values in the access window are not updated. But when you click the refresh button, it'll update and show you the latest values. Also, if you want to get around your graphics window, we've got these two buttons here, which will go to the units that are collect connected to this unit. So if I click on the going back arrow, it takes us to the unit that the pipe is coming from. And you can see it's gone magenta, the autoclave is there. If I click the back again, the autoclave has three pipes coming into it. P004, 005, and 003 and you can navigate to any of those. So if I go to 003, we'll see it takes us back there and go back again to the tank. And if you go forward, again it moves forward in the same way. And here we get back to P007. If I go to the Q0 page, we have a button which is Include Properties. If I click on that, these are additional properties that you might want to show on your pipes. For instance, the pH estimate. If you turn on any of these on, then they will be turned on globally for all links in your project. For instance, if I go and turn on pH estimate on this page over here, and here you can see the estimate. 